Well, hello and welcome to this month's New Moon Guided Meditation. I'm Helen Pengelly, spiritual coach and mentor and founder of Heal with Helen. We're almost at the at the summer solstice now. The sun is almost at its highest point in the northern hemisphere before it starts to go go back south again. So we're enjoying lovely long days, light evenings. I'm still I'm still not used to them. It's weird, <laughs> but um. I, I still get caught out. Oh, it's 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 eight o'clock and I'm thinking it's about five or something. Anyway, I digress. Um, the new moon, as ever, is a good time to to go to go within. We're always connected to the energy of the moon anyway, because our bodies are something like 70, 75 percent water. And we see the effect that the moon has on the tides and the magnetic pull of the moon is is strongest at the new moon and the full moon so maybe some you you've noticed i mean for for example i notice like especially at the full moon i often have difficulty sleeping and i and if i've forgotten it's full moon and then i wake up and oh, i didn't sleep very well last night and then i realize it it was a full moon so the thing is, with, with, with meditation as well, you become more in tune w w with nature the more you meditate and, and the natural cycles uh, of the earth. Because we live in a kind of 24-7 society these days where we can, the sh we can go shopping at any time of day, work, work patterns have, have changed and, you know, a lot of people work night shifts and work at weekends and we we get out of sync with, with, with the natural rhythms of the world and the same with our food we import food from all over the world so we can eat anything any time of the year whereas before we would be eating seasonally with the the food that that was only available because it grew at, at that time of the year so we're, we're all dis so disconnected now for, from nature. We kind of think, oh, we're separate from it, but we're not because we're, we're, we're animals <laughs> at the end of the day, aren't we? We, we are living, breathing, and we, we breathe in the air and the oxygen, which is given off by the trees. They take that our carbon dioxide and convert it back into oxygen. So everything is interdependent. And so it's really important, I think, to be to be in tune with that and, and reconnect with, with nature. And and I've noticed as well, you know, that that now well, I've been meditating a long time. And then after a few years, I, I much more appreciated like the beauty of a sunset or just being out in the countryside and just the, the, in the spring, like the fresh greenness of everything and I think it was because I was becoming less distracted and was more aware because I'm more aware of myself and you become more aware of your feelings what's going on internally you also become more aware of what's going on externally so let's meditate and the new moon is is a good time if, if you wish to review any intentions you made maybe at the last new moon to review those maybe um, some things didn't work out the way you wanted maybe things need to be be changed or reviewed whatever or maybe you just want to sit take some time just for some peace and quiet the time to go within so when you're ready um I'll go and turn off any distractions and um, so you can be fully present now for, for this meditation and then if you wish you can close your eyes I'm just paying attention to the sound of the bell I'm going to ring it again actually and we're just going to listen tune in to that sound until it fades away.
and noticing your breath. And the breath is a great way to come into the present because it's always there. Anytime you need to, just take a pause. Feel the body moving. Feel the sensation of the air as it enters and leaves the nostrils. Just checking in with yourself. Notice how you're feeling. Any thoughts, emotions. And just imagine that your body you are filling up with a peaceful, calming energy. You can visualize a new moon if you wish. Because when the moon is it's small when it's new. The nights are darker. There's less animal activity. And everyone, everything just naturally slows down. So allowing yourself to do that now. Notice the breath slowing down and if you want, the breath is a bit fast. If you're feeling a bit anxious, you might want to consciously breathe more slowly and deeply. And just feeling a sense of peace and calm within your heart and allowing that to radiate out to the rest of your body. And as we move through into a new 
lunar month. Reconnecting with your highest purpose for this life. It doesn't have to be anything grand. It can be important things like loving yourself more, healing yourself and healing the world. Whatever feels right for you now that maybe you've kind of lost your way a bit. Time to reconnect with that inner purpose. And if you're not sure at the moment what that is, that's fine too. Just remain open, curious. You don't have to have all the answers. Just have faith. Every step you take is moving in the right direction. There's nowhere else to go, nowhere else to be, just sitting and even if you're finding it hard to find any peace at the moment, that's okay, just acknowledge that's your current reality. Having the intention that there will be more, the more you take time for yourself to meditate, to slow down, reconnect with nature. And whatever is coming up for you, notice, be aware, any moments of insight, and if there aren't any, that's okay too.
remembering, get distracted, caught up in thinking. The breath is always there as an anchor. And now, adding a sense of peace and calm that's filling your body, extend beyond the physical body. You can imagine it surrounding you like a bubble, keeping you safe. And knowing that that extends and touches others too when they come into contact with you. The more grounded you are, the more peaceful you feel. Other people will pick up on that unconsciously. So as we come to the end of this meditation, I'm sure you don't go rushing around into the next thing and take some time to integrate those feelings so they become more a more natural part of your life enabling you to be connected to the rest of the world the rest of the universe the rest of nature which we're not separate from anyway. In a moment, I'm going to ring the bell and just sit and listen as the sound fades away.
Thank you for joining me today. You might want to take some extra time just to carry on sitting, cultivating more of that sense, sense of peace. You might want to journal about anything that came up or do some just free writing, stream of consciousness writing about whatever come up, whatever comes up for you. Or ask your guides for some wisdom if any questions that you want answered. Just play with it, be creative, but don't go off rushing into the next thing. Take some time just to ground that sense of feeling of calm and peacefulness. I'll see you again very soon. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification button if you haven't already. And I wish you a wonderful rest of the day. Take care, go well and lots of love.